Elvis and I got a lot in common, I think, so I bought them. And he got hooked, and he couldn't stop collecting them. My goal was 40, and I ended up getting close to 400 velvet paintings, which, according to people in the know, is probably the largest collection in North America. Today, we are uh, at the Glenbow Museum in the amazing velvet experience. These paintings are really interesting because they come from one collection, uh, which was collected by Rick Smith. Honestly, I love velvet paintings. <laughs> I might be alone in that to a certain extent. They are uh, kind of the people's paintings, you know. They were made for everyone, they were accessible, they were cheap, uh, and they have some pretty hilarious imagery on them as well. Almost 17 years ago, and I was diagnosed with pulmonary fibrosis. I was on an awful lot of medications, and I don't mean that jokingly. Art became really uh, exciting for me, but it kept me alive, literally. Rick has said that these paintings really helped him through a very difficult time in his life, so I think he feels like he's on the other end of that, and he's willing to share them with the rest of Calgary. The big thing that's happening uh, at the end of today's event, uh, every guest will be able to take home their very own velvet painting. It's a fun hobby. I said it gave me something to do when I was very ill and thankful for that.